Hello and welcome back to our Pokemon Alpha Sapphire series. In the last episode, we made it to Most Deep City uh, after going to Lily Grove, the Team Aqua base. As you can see, we have got a Tangrowth because we needed to level it up with having uh, Agent Power at level 38 and then evolved. We once got level 45s and 3 level 40s because that's a fair balance of a team. If they're all, if some of them are not all at one level, yeah, we just went in the gym. I can't remember what the gym is, and lost deep. She's a bicycle. Mm. Nice item. Ooh. New to a note why that would be pretty good actually. Find it, find it, find a Mewtwo. Made up a new item. I'm pretty sure the gym's on this level. The gym's right, the gym's behind the um, I put a uh, Pokemon. Yeah, we did the team Aqua Base, got the Master Ball. So if we do find a Mewtwo, we could just use a Master Ball on it. That is a good point though. But we got Tangrowth. It's pretty good. But we will need to do the gym. I know about these trainers. Oh, I can. I can avoid the trainers. I think I do need to turn my XP share on as well. Yeah, I turned off because uh, I got down to needing to level up one Pokemon. So. Not all, tra not all trainers that we'll be able to avoid. New and we'll better avoid them all, but because so some gyms are um, trainers in the gym find legendaries. Now, of course, there's a few issues. Does have poison jet, but we have acrobatics, and acrobatics is should be super effective. Plus. Acrobatics with the high attack of Archops is just a little bit overpowered. And the Bisharp, which is Dark Steel, so we'll switch to Milo. We're a flamethrower. I like the matter of Milo the end time. Well, well, I don't know, just one thing. I thought maybe being on high level might have a bit better defense. Defeated Psychic Fritz. Kill the ride that train there. I could have gone straight down and avoided it, but I didn't know if I could. It's a swab blue. The early evolution of Altaria. Does have Dragon Pulse. I have Dragon Breath, which should be super effective. It isn't. Is it because it's flying resist dragon? Good athletics. 
Acrobatic is just so strong. Coin Clan we will switch. We can switch to Milo. We hit the Steel. And Fire is obviously stronger than Steel. Because Fire heats Steel. Exerting pressure. One hit. Ooh. Just survived it. Charge room does minimal to nothing, but it does boost a special attack, so we're just gonna use Stomp to finish it. Not very effective, but it only had to roll out five health, five health left. Them to go north, which should allow us to go straight to the gym. The gym leaders. And the gym leaders. It's Tate and Liza. We take on the gym. Prison is Tate and Liza. So you finish each other's sentences. <laughs> as long as you don't have like legendaries, we should be fine. Reggie Gigas and Raichu. Okay, well, I know which one I'm focusing on first. Man, the right two is quite scary actually. Maybe I should Maybe I should try and hit that with one move and then um We'll do that. Acrobatics the Rage Gigas. Aeroblast the right two. Right, you just T-Bolt, that's gonna hurt. One hex potato. That's not fun. Now we're confused. I guess now the smart the smart switch here is is look is looks right, because Thunderbolt will be not very effective. That's not fun. Extra sense here in my shoe. As long as it doesn't hit itself. It shouldn't one hit both of them. We got the flint but Yay. I'm gonna th instead I'm gonna thunderfang Reggie I guess at this time. And I'm gonna extra sensory again the Raichu. These is a high portion of Raichu. At least it's not Thunderbolt though. At least we know we're not gonna get Thunderbolted. Needs a bit of confusion there. No, we're just not that lucky. Let's use Thunder Fang. Hopefully, it, take, uh, uh, it can do enough damage to knock out the Red Gigas. No, it. Oh no. It's using Revenge.
I did need to heal both 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 turns. Which is what we're going to do. They use their second high potion as well, which is a little bit frustrating. That's a little bit. That's a little bit. That's a little bit annoying. It uses thunderbolt. I don't know how to double up on the right shoe. It might have to be bite them fly. So that's it's confusing. Fly's, fly's pretty strong, but it's not going to be not very, it's not very, very, very effective. Revenge do nothing to not actually hit it. What I'm going to do is predict the Thunderbolt back again on Luvia. I'm going to heal it with his uh, with Lux's turn and with a high potion. Put up a wide guard. He's just T-Bolt on Lux. Five two hits. So we're gonna bite the right you, but we're then gonna heal Luxury. It's a good thing I bought more potions. The right you took out Terra though. That's really quite frustrating. Cause that's another flying Pokemon that we've lost. T Bolt will obviously go into Desire. So we got the crit, we got it in the right shoe. Oof. Use the vengeance looks. What I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna switch looks out for Milo as I use Aeroblast and Regigas. Confuser against Lydia, that's fine ish. Gonna launch a flamethrower. And we're gonna be gonna big brain it and we're gonna use a full heal. Full heal to snap him out of the confusion. Alright, then launch the confusion against. That's kind of annoying. I don't need my little break out confusion. Yes, that's good. Keeps playing for a while. That literally didn't do a thing. I guess next we stomp and then we can use fly. Could break sex confusion again. Which it does. Don't do much. Easy revenge. It's gonna hurt. 
Uh, and then we'll just heal this turn. Because then there was literally nothing I could have done about the right you one hit in because it used them block. If I'd been flying ground, it wouldn't have been it wouldn't have affected me, but Then do I create a cave? So no matter what now, we should knock it out with any move. They should knock it out. Yeah. Oof. I was have fight one. The Zygo is level 46. Pro level on Lux and Tang Tangle. Yep, level 42. On Slow and Crunch. Yes, we'll get rid of. Uh, we'll get rid of. We'll get rid of Charge. So we've got two Dark Moves, two Electric Moves. So we can have Crunch and Bite. Scribble gets a uh, level. We get 10 to the for winning, but we do lose probably one of our stronger, like the strong guys, the two that were the highest, like, highest level. Best by 7. We take Ooh, Pound Mind. Ooh, that's pretty good actually. Okay, we yeah. could heal. Use the walk back to the beginning. Okay. Well, that happened. Ooh. Um. Okay. Route 128. The is terrified. Came down from out there. I steer in terms of seas. I was like, oh yeah, you need to go to bed. You need to go to sea, isn't it? Wait for it. <laughs> you should tell us go to my place. Okay. Okay, yeah, there's an explosion there's a there's a massive thing. A sea flat cavern, okay. You need me hit the HM for dive then? Because. Yeah. It's the only way we're reaching it. Okay. 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 It's kind of so frustrating because it's like. It's the minimum I could have done about that one. Like, some were silly played by me, but that was. That one was nothing I could have done about. I'll probably. Pick a Pokemon in between, in between this episode and the next episode. We're gonna heal, obviously. So it does take us back down to a team of four. Which just seems what we're gonna have. We keep going against like team five, team six. 
We seem to just lose things at gym uh, in gyms. But right, you with a T-ball. If it done more, if it done a desire, I'm gonna be able to get acrobatics off. Maybe if I probably acrobatics the right you. Probably a bit, maybe a bit more success, but that'll be of course where we end today's episode. So thank you for watching. Please don't like, subscribe. Until next time, see ya.